And the winner of the 77th annual water drinking competition is... Jasmine! For winning, you get rewarded with a grand prize, a gold straw. Oh, screw this, I'm out of here. Mr. Barrington, I had that dream again. Oh, but Mr. Barrington, it was such a good contest all those moons ago. In fact, the judge even stated that I could drink a world's worth of water. Anyway, I best make a start on the day ahead. Get back to bed, honey. Meanwhile, at the Cumber Corporation. So, can any of you numbskulls explain why our prophets are down percent on our underwater breathing headsets? I guess people just don't need the headsets as much as we thought. Yeah, folks just want to stay on dry land. If there was a way to force them to use the headsets, then maybe... No, oh useless input. What do I pay you idiots for? Um, sir, you, you don't pay us. Quiet! I have an idea. If we float the entire world with water, the world's population will be forced to buy these stupid headsets. And then, and then we'll be rich. Rich! <laughs> Great idea, sir. Most excellent suggestion, sir. Yes, it is a good idea, isn't it? And do you know why it's such a good idea? Why, sir? Because, you idiot. Because it's my idea. Of course, sir. Now, in order to flood the world, we need to disable all the water pumps, destroy all the dams, and confiscate all the straws. Don't just stand there. Get to it. I'm just a plant. Don't pay me any attention. Ah! 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 The golden star, my baby. The one object that plucks at my heartstrings with every waking breath. Ah! 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 But oh, I best go answer it. I wonder who it could be. Why, whomever could it be? I am ever so excited to open the door. What? Uh, are you here for me, sir? No! Uh, that's okay. Nobody is ever here for me. I'm just a... Just a plant. Yeah, I get it. Excuse me, uh, who are you and why are you kicking down my door? May I come in? No. Tough on coming in anyway. Uh, nice house. I like a carpet. Anyway, down to business. My name is Mr. Devil, and I am a representative of the evil Cumber Corporation. I hear that you have a straw that needs confiscating. I just wanted to make friends. Oi! Hands off a straw. No, you have no authority here, Mr. Jasson. No authority whatsoever. Grr, this is the last straw. 
Uh, that's precisely the issue. You see, it is the last star. Uh -uh. <laughs> now get out of my house! You call that a transformation? <laughs> Weak. Now get out of the house, you devil! You call that a transformation? No, oh, here am I kidding, I'm just a... Yes, a plant, we... yes, we know. <sighs> the next day, at the Cumber Corporation. So... You failed to get the straw because a granny roared at you, is that what you're saying? She was very scary. She, she must be the protector of a straw. There's no way you can just stroll in and take it. So, all our plans could be put in jeopardy then. Uh, but, but, but it's okay, I have a plan. If we put in our own spy, our own plant into Jasm's house, we can fetch the last straw. Excellent, Mr. Devil. Unleash the spy, and we'll commence the flooding tonight. Yes, sir. <laughs> Are you still here, Mr. Devil? Love you, sir. L love you, too. Meanwhile, at a Jasm residence, just heading to the shop plant. I'll be back soon. Glorious day, isn't it, Mr. Jasm? Uh, yes, it is, son. Yes, it is. Uh, stop right there, friend. Thank you very much. Uh, welcome to Deceitful Joe's Honest Truck Shop. Uh, buy a truck or truck off is our motto. Uh, and, sir, you appear to have a bear sticking out of you. <laughs> That rare bear is as a part of me as your hair is a part of you. Been a part of me ever since the surgery following the truck incident of 67. Bad memories. Anyway, we're not here for a history lesson. W would you like to buy a flying truck, sir? A flying truck? It, yes, it's like a truck, but, uh, but, 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 but what? But it flies. No thanks. Well, I, I'll, I'll tell you what. I'll give you a flute mouthpiece, give it a blow, and we'll swoop down and give you a whirl in a fine truck. Uh, sure thing, sir. Anyway, I'll be off. See ya. Yeah, bye. And remember, if you want a good truck, you know where we are. <laughs> Can you believe it? Didn't know what a fine truck was. Unbelievable. What is the world coming to? It's still, at least we got rid of all the flute mouthpieces, all in an honest day's work. Oi, I heard that. Uh, I, I, I'm, I'm sorry. Here, take, take these underwater breathing headsets. Underwater breathing headsets? Yeah, they like headsets, but... But what? But, get this, they are headsets that you can wear underwater. Shopping. Bye. Be seeing you. <laughs> right, can you believe it? Didn't know what an underwater headset was. Unbelievable. What is the world coming to? Still, at least we got rid of all those underwater headsets. All in an honest day's work. Fly. <coughs> Me. Meanwhile, back at the Jasm residence. Hey, I'm just a... Just a plant, yeah. I get it. Well, how very rude of you. We only just replaced the store. Tough shit, plant. I'm Mr. Devil. I do not care for doors. Doors quake in fear at the sight of me. Adorable. Whatever, you're coming with me, plant. Just made myself at home, then, and prepare operation.
straw retrieval. Uh, wait, I swear I fixed this door earlier. Uh, d do you know what happened, plant? Nope, don't know what happened. Why, plant? You look different today. But my, what big eyes you have. Oh, all the better to see you with. Mm, and, and, and what big claws you have. All the better to touch you with. And what big teeth you have. All the better to eat you with. What? Uh, uh, what I meant to say was, um, <clears throat> don't mind me. <laughs> I'm just a plant. <laughs> That night at a Kung Pa Corporation. Got a panzer. Nice. Now we flood the world. Breaking news. Breaking news. The world is due to be flooded. As we speak, the Cumber Corporation is flooding the globe. You may wish to purchase an underwater breathing headset today. It's the only way to save yourself. This is Noah, at six, signing out. We best put on a helmet and fast. Thanks. Uh, I'm just going to give the helmet to Mr. Barrington. Uh, don't go anywhere, plant. Now, time to grab last draw. Uh, a plant, I think it's best if we get upstairs. Come on, let's go. I'll grab the straw later, but Jasmine is a nuisance, I'll get rid of him first. I who are you and what are you doing in my house? I am a beautiful mermaid, and I have a bone to pick with you guys. Follow me to my office. Well, we best go. Come on, plant, we'll go together. Sure, just let me fetch your straw first. Uh, forget the straw. Forget the straw. We don't need it. It's not necessary, and I'm tired. We need to go to this meeting. No, us merfolk are not happy that you land lovers are hanging about underwater with all these silly helmets. What, what about the people who weren't able to grab a helmet? Oh. They found a way to survive. S so, what's the problem? If all of humanity stays stacked on one another, they're out of the ocean, then. You would think, but no. They are ordering these underwater breathing headsets in bulk and coming underwater, mudging up our territory with their filthy lives and stinking attitudes. Uh, so, uh, how do we get things back to normal? We build a time machine and go back. B but it's impossible to travel through time. Excuses, excuses, excuses. I don't want excuses, Jasm. I want results. And I need that straw. Wait, what did you say, plant? Um, I'm just a plant. No, the straw, the straw. What was it about the straw? In fact, the judge even stated that I could drink a world's worth of water. That's it! What's it? If I can get back home, I can grab my straw and drink all the excess water and everything will be back to normal. Sounds like a stupid plan will never work. Sounds perfect. I'll call a submarine over to take you back home. Awesome. Let's go, plant. Yes. Oh, shut up. You're just a plant. I am more than just a plant. Uh, you're just a pile of ashes. Well, I guess we just wait here until the sub arrives. I'm just a clam. Don't pay me any attention. Shut it, it wasn't funny with a plant, not funny with a clam. I'm a clam, pay me attention, pay me attention, pay me attention. That shut it up. Uh, but you threw a poor clam. It'll be fine, clams are like boomerangs, they like being, being thrown. N no we don't. Oh shut it, you're just a clam. 
Meanwhile, at the Cumber Corporation. Look, Mr. Devil, profits for our underwater helmets are through the roof. Be excellent, sir. You still here, Mr. Devil? C can we make love? I thought you'd never ask. But before anything, get rid of that bloody plan has been doing my head in. Uh, yes, sir. Good riddance. All aboard a mellow yellow submarine. Welcome aboard. We are the Beatles. And I'm a quarryman. I don't believe this. I can hear the phone going. Can you grab that roll? Uh, sure thing, Bingo. Uh, terrible news. It seems our mermaid friend has been murdered. What? But me and my plant were just with him. That must mean there's a plant, uh, a spy among us. Right, uh, it must be one of them two, and probably the mean-looking one. Uh, there's no spy! The spy will probably have sharp claws and fangs, right, lads? Right. And probably a ray gun that they just dropped. Uh, true. N no, not true. I ain't a spy. It's not me. Wait, wait a minute, lads. Wouldn't a spy be all innocent and inconspicuous? Uh, maybe. So it must be Jasm. He's a spy, a bastard! Excuse me, I'm not a spy. There's something a spy would say. I knew it was Jasm all along. I had my suspicions from off for some, I say. Yeah, yeah, it must be true. Take his helmet off him, too. Any last words? It, it wasn't me. Yes, it was. Get rid of him. <sighs> now, let's go eat a plant. What? what? Not if I eat you first. Just like a boomerang. Picks up a window, plants on a menu, boys. Yes, I'm gonna drown. And there's nothing I can do. The, the flute mouthpiece, of course. I could call the flying truck. Oh, plant, uh, the other plant must have been fake all along. I'm just a plant. You're better than a plant. You're my friend. I'll get us out of this. Nothing. I, I guess we're done for after all. Off on in. Oh, here we are in our flying truck, and we don't give a flying truck. And if anyone tells us to chuck off, we'll tell them to heartily chuck themselves and scoff. Whoa, we chuck all day and we chuck all night, we chuck in the dark and get chucked in the light, and if anyone says chucking that long game right, we tell them to chuck off with all our might. Where we chucking to off to, boys? Uh, take me home. Be seeing you. Jasmine. You did it. You saved us all. No, we did it. But... Uh, but what? I'm just a plant. I feel... bloated? I'm just a shelving unit. Don't pay me any attention. Oi, that's my line. 